What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we are checking out top 12 amazing places to travel in the Netherlands guys. So let's actually see what we got here today guys. If you're new here we do reactions around Netherlands and other countries here and there. So if you're into that guys want to learn a few things stick around. So like the video guys subscribe to the channel and yeah check out our Patreon for exclusive content. Check out our Discord link below in the description. And let's get on with the video. Let's see what we got here today. Let's get it. Welcome to the land of tulips, canals, tulips, and canals windmills. And windmills, brother. That's With life. its vibrant cities, world-class museums, medieval structures, canal cruises, famous well, landmarks, just world famous bro. cheese, endless stretch of tulip fields, and combination of classic and modern Dutch culture Netherlands is the such an interesting well, country to visit. Even though it is small, there is no shortage of things to do in this beautiful country. So this is Scenic Hunter's fascinating journey to find the 12 best places to visit in the Netherlands. Alright, let's check it out. I mean, sounds interesting, so let's see what we actually got, guys. Number 12, Volendam. Volendam is a small Volendam. Dutch town that lies wow. on the Markermeer Lake in the northeast of Amsterdam. That looks the amazing, 19th bro. century town is known as the Pearl of the Zuider Zee. Its colorful wooden houses like line literally banks, this is stunning. This reminds me of like old fishing cartoon cities, of that sort of thing. Year. It offers a scenic boat ride to the historic hamlet, lovely museums, countryside vibes, and delicious traditional cheese. That's just amazing, man. Amazing. Look at all that green color. Number 11, Hauda. Hauda. Hauda is in the western region of the... Never actually heard of this city before, interesting. The Netherlands, close to The Hague and Rotterdam. Okay. Oh. Although it is one of the smallest cities in South Holland, it still stands wow, as a that. popular tourist destination due to its historical wealth and heritage of delicious cheese called Hauda. Hauda Cheese Market, the Church of wow, St. John, Hauda bro. Market Square, the museum, and traditional foods are some of the most attractive things in the city. The buildings look amazing. Number 10, Zantshans. Zantshans. Zantshans is a well-preserved medieval town and a perfect destination for a short day trip. Wow, green houses, bro. The city is considered an open-air museum different. with full of authentic Dutch handicrafts and culture. It is a popular international... Bro, honestly, just the colors here, so bright, green, that is beautiful. Like, come on, guys. Just look at that view, bro tourist destination Amazing. and an anchor point of the European route of industrial heritage. You can have a cycling or sailing trip, enjoy the taste and smell of fresh cookies, explore cheese factories, various windmills, and wooden houses and meet hospitable locals. Wow. The snow as well, that just looks... Wow. Number 9, Leiden. Leiden. The Netherlands. Never heard of this either before. This is full of beautiful so cities, we've got. but Leiden is one of the best cities you shouldn't miss. Leiden is an extraordinarily diverse city located between The Hague and Amsterdam. The city is charismatic with its features, including lush green landscapes, beautiful medieval towns, and dozens of small canals. Leiden is spotted in an extensive flower-growing area. 
therefore it provides a spectacular display of flowers in the summer months. Just beautiful. Number 8, Rotterdam. Of course. Rotterdam is a major port city and the second largest city in the Netherlands province of South Holland. The Rotterdam is full of serene landscapes and rich fauna and flora, golden sand dunes, and stunning beaches. The vibrant and multicultural city offers trendy nightlife, architectural masterpieces, shopping options, excellent foods, and a wide range of museums. Wow, nightlife as well, bro. Must be amazing. Number seven, Utrecht. Utrecht. Okay, Utrecht. Utrecht is the fourth largest city, located in the heart of the Netherlands. The history of the city is dated back to the early Middle Ages. Even though Utrecht is one of the ancient cities in the country, it is perfectly blended with modern culture. Okay. You can explore the magnificent canal area, railway museum, Dom Tower, and Botanic Gardens while taking a bicycle tour to experience the perfect view of the city. Wow, bro. That view from above, I mean... I like the green color, like so colorful, Netherlands in general, so colorful, it's insane. Number six, Texel Island. Texel Island. Texel is an island located in North Holland. The island is considered the largest and most populated island on West Frisian Island. Texel Island is an excellent mix of pristine beaches, lovely seven villages, and unique nature reserves. Okay. It is one of the most prominent trip options in the Netherlands. You can climb the iconic Texel Lighthouse, soak into rich and dynamic history, walk in the unique beach landscapes, explore Dutch architecture, and relax your mind and soul while exploring the natural beauty and endearing charm. Marvel, so true, so true. Like literally guys, I'm actually amazed. Number five, The Hague. The Hague. The Hague is a historical city in the Netherlands located on the western coast of the country facing the North Sea. Okay. The Hague is an excellent place to get a good taste of the Dutch history of the country. The city offers dozens of cozy businesses including world-class art galleries, stores, shops, and restaurants. Guys, let me know which cities you actually visited from this video and let me know which one was your favorite so when i visit the netherlands next year probably I, I will have a good idea to where to visit the most so yeah let me know your thoughts on this below as well you can explore wonderful old buildings great wow. beaches fishing villages and museums while soaking in the endearing charm and warm seaside towns Number four, Kinderdijk. Kinderdijk. Kinderdijk is a scenic village that lies in the Heard South Holland province before. in the Netherlands. The village is well known for its iconic windmills. Yep. The outstanding network of windmills is a wonderful human creation and a perfect example of the Dutch history of water management. And also it was declared a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The 19 windmills were used to keep the soil dry by avoiding floods. 
Just imagine, guys. Kinderdijk Just imagine. is an ideal destination to experience a traditional Netherland village. Wow. Number 3, Kalkenhof Flower Park. Flower Park. Netherland is world famous due to their tulip farms of and course, which produce the tulips, over 3 bro. billion tulip bulbs yearly. Wow. Dutch maintained the number 1 position and the commercial devotion to this amazing flower. Every September, over 1 million tulip bulbs from over 120 varieties arrive in the Netherlands and the planting begins every October in different places including tulip farms, okay. city streets and gardens almost everywhere in Holland. Like I mean this thing is nice if you go visit Netherlands like just go look at all those beautiful colors of flowers like in a garden that would be amazing like really guys. Over 32 hectares large Kalkenhof Park is an amazing site to enjoy blooming. If you guys got any images by the way of like beautiful flowers, like colorful things, send them in Discord, let's check them out together. All of us can check them out as well. Kalkenhof offers you a colorful flowery day trip wow. full of unforgettable memories. Every year, they plant around 7 million flower bulbs. That is insane. Number 2. Gieton Gieton is a Dutch tourist destination located in the province of Overijssel, Netherlands. This charming village is very popular and is referred to as Venice of the Netherlands. Okay. This picture-perfect village is in the middle of a beautiful nature reserve. All of the houses are made entirely of wood and bridges are the only way to reach them. Wow. So that it has insane. more than 180 bridges that crisscross over these beautiful canals run through the village. Oh, it's just Normally crazy, the bro. cars are parked outside the village. Gieton is a popular ice skating destination. So during the winter season, you can skate on these beautiful canals and waterways. Wow. Like these houses as well, bro. Look at that thatching on the roof. That is amazing. Just amazing, bro. Amsterdam. Number one, Let's see. Amsterdam. Let's see what we got. Amsterdam is the capital wow. of the Netherlands and is also known as is the Is that Venice actually how it is? Like the buildings are actually on the water. I need to check out more videos like these. If you've got any guys, suggest them onto the Discord. Let's check them out the as north, well. Due to its canal system and Jerusalem of the North, because of its previous high population wow. of Jewish people. It is a unique city and well known for its elaborate canal system, artistic heritage, and narrow houses. Amsterdam was a hot spot in the old during the Dutch Golden Age period of the 17th century. Beautiful museums, proud historical buildings, strolling through beautiful city parks going for an exciting boat tour on the canals, nighttime festive fun, and cycle tours on the widely spread cycle path are some of the most highlighting things in Amsterdam. Wow. Sounds like fun, I would say. Amazing views as well, sunset. Wow, bro. These views from above, I absolutely love these, man. This sort of stuff, or these things are memories, you know. We do hope you enjoyed our journey. Wow, that was the end of this. Well, let me know, guys, your thoughts on it in the comments below. And yeah, hope you enjoyed. If you're new here, and if you're not, if you did enjoy, like the video, guys, subscribe to the channel. And yeah, that's it for today's video. We'll be seeing you on the next one, guys. Peace out.